going on guys? It's Kuday here and today we're going to be doing a video on Mortal Kombat The Battle Pass. So, we have not done a video on the Combat Pass ever and I plan to right now actually. Because uh, why not? So, it's for Dark Raiden. Dark Raiden is really nice. He looks amazing and his fusion X, oh, sorry, not fusion X, fusion 15 stat looks pretty cool. But what was he, what, what is he going to be like at fusion level 20? And have the developers added anything special for fusion level 20 in general? Well, we're going to provide answers for both of those things in this video. So first off, it, it does have a pretty decent uh, reward. I don't think anything has really changed. Everything se seems to be the same, uh, but most importantly, uh, they give a really good reward after completing the combat pass, which we're going to have a look at uh, after we purchase it. So first off, let's start by purchasing the combat pass. Okay, so now we're going to ascend Dark Raiden to max. We have the premium. We're going to click buy and go to 60. 24,000 souls. We're just going to skip it all. I want to get the big glump of rewards because why the heck not? Yeah, okay. Wow. It is kind of fun to look at all these rewards. You know what I'm saying? But you get all these ascension cards and Raidens along with the cool little, um, what do they call that? Icon? Yeah, icon for that. Okay. I just click on the card. Oops. So, 104 cards, or not 104, 105 cards to claim, skip all, here's the big glup of rewards if you do want to see what it would look like, 425 rubies, don't mind if I do, but for $10, probably not worth it, especially spending 24,000 souls, but if you have some extra souls lying around, it's not too bad, uh, and I also get the cool icons, one for this, and one for the Fusion uh, 15 Ascension, which, by the way, looks really cool, actually. See, Dark Raiden is my favorite version of Raiden in MK Mobile still. I, I, I just love Dark Raiden. Ever since he came out, he's been an absolute beast, and I used to use him all the time. And maybe I'll start using him now that he has this ascension, because he looks so much cooler than he did before. Uh, actually, we're going to go here, and we're going to go sort by golds, and go straight over to my boy Raiden. Where is he? Here he is. So this is Dark Raiden. Now we have five ascensions, so let's get started. Ooh, I love watching this animation. Already looks like a powerhouse. I wish it was only a fusion level 15 though, but still pretty damn cool. So we're gonna go right to five. Here we go, here we go. Ooh, satisfying. There we go, fusion level 15. Now, um, yeah, I, I just I just love that lightning. So now brutality is unlocked. To be able to use brutality, you must have both of these set pieces for Raiden. And I'm sure friendship will be an option for this kind of stuff in the future, but probably at fusion level 20. But you're probably wondering, okay, if it's at fusion level 20, then why is it not unlockable? And that's because the developers just don't have it enabled. So we're gonna do this, this, and this. Have three of the combat pass characters all on one team, um, which there's about to be a fourth, but not for now. Okay, let's let's go put on everything that we need. First, we gotta start with the Thunderlord Sigil. Uh, I think I might as well just sort by Nightmare, am I right? Okay, so this is the two brutality pieces, one, two, and it'll say Raiden set now that he is a Fusion Level 15 card, instead of just blanking out because it, he wasn't available. Um, but yeah, look at that. Look at that, all three of them. Sonya probably has to look the worst. Right? Yeah, I think Sonya has to look the worst here out of the bunch. Like, she looks good because it's brighter, but honestly, there's no aesthetic um, to it. Besides, you know, Raiden, Raiden has an incredible aesthetic added on to his character card. But that's not what we're judging in this video. We're going to add the rest of the brutalities. So now we have all three of the brutalities on each character. Number one, number two, and number three. And we will be playing at Fusion Level 20 on all of them. But we're going to first start off with Fusion Level 15 to show off the brutality. Because they actually did do a, a major change to all Raiden characters as a whole. Okay. So number one, uh, the lightning changes. So if we take a look here, if I do this, should be different. Yep. 
it's blue. Ooh, it looks so cool. It's like a nice little blue color, but it doesn't really fit the fact that Dark Raiden is Dark Raiden. Why is it blue exactly? It looks nice, but it doesn't really fit Raiden's character. I would say that um, that would fit more of a Thunder God Raiden aesthetic. But for Dark Raiden, he's just the same as MK11 Raiden, but the only difference is that it's from MKX. But how is that really different besides the aesthetic uh, looking just slightly different and more outdated? I don't know. Okay, we're fighting a diamond team, a really good one at that. Uh, we did have to swap our characters out, but sacrifices had to be made. I want to fight something strong, if you know what I'm saying, and not something that's going to red card me. I don't need that. Woo! His combo owners are not that bad. Which is, I used to play him for many, 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 many years. Uh, so honestly, ooh, beautiful. Wait, his lightning overall is also blue if you take a look at that. See that? His lightning is blue overall. Why is that? He's not a tame version of Raiden. He is supposed to be corrupted. It's right after MKX. Huh. Strange. Oh, it does not look right. Wait, what? Block breaker? I just went through his block. How'd that happen? Like, I I guess I was surprised because he was blocking while I, while I did the block breaker. Two brutal endings so far. Woo! Wait, speaking of, do we even have a block breaker on him? Oh, Sindel's actually tagging in pretty well with him. Ooh. Okay, we're still using SP2. No, no, please don't kill me. We are, in fact, dead. So we can't do actual brutality. Darn. Where is MK11 Melina? Where is she? Developers need to explain themselves. We're another diamond team. Let's go. We do have to leave and come back with a one match. A quick play because finding diamond teams in faction wars regularly is kind of difficult. You, you always do when you don't want to. Okay. I'm just trying to get a feel for his combo wonders overall. They're not bad. He just he doesn't push them back very much compared to MK11 Raiden. I still think his his combos are definitely better than MK11 Raiden's combos. It is. Yeah, it is. It's a lot easier to keep spamming. It's just been a while since I've played this version of Raiden. You know what I mean? Like I haven't played this Raiden in so long. I played him really as a beginner. Okay, so we're gonna use SP3. Shock therapy. Yeah. This is like if they gave MK11 Raiden lightning strikes uh, that were blue. <laughs> they don't. Unless they do now. I'll have to go check. No, wait. No, I don't want to kill him. Are we going to kill him? Ooh, okay. Okay. Damn it! Okay, so this is Raiden at fusion level 20 now. Circle Shot is Liu Kang, please do not kill me. Oh, oh wait, th this is funny because this is kind of what happened in MKX. A bunch of the revenants tried to fight Raiden. And he kicked their he kicked their butts. Ooh. We're getting kicked in the butt right now though. Wait, it was these three revenants! What? Okay, that's kind of funny. It's literally these three revenants that kicked his butt. Okay, we're gonna use SP2 again. Maybe we can do it another time against Kung Lao, please. Okay, we hopefully don't kill him off, right? Oh boy. Dang it! We were very close, at least. So when I was a beginner, one of the best things about using Dark Raiden was his ability to tank any sort of dot because he would just regen and most importantly the power drain did nothing to him it would just it would just give him power it was super useful on my beginner account and mournful katana and every single katana character was very popular on faction wars at the time for me at least me uh and i was able to avoid damage um not, not damage per se but i was able to avoid being power drained and tank all those sp1s uh easily because i could actually fight back against it um but one thing about Raiden is definitely how slow he is compared to MK11 Raiden. Uh, also, I really like seeing them side by side because it's so different. I mean, w one 
like, side by side, they're, they're supposed to be the same character, per se, um, but you can see the two art styles clash, and I think it's really cool. Okay. Please, I gotta focus here. Dang it. Okay, he's gonna regen his little, little his health back. That's okay, though. I was hoping that he would. Please? Yes! I am lightning and thunder. Remember when Raiden used to make like three lightnings as a glitch and he would just <laughs> handle three lightnings in his in his hands? Yeah, honestly, that was kind of funny. But that is going to wrap up this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure you leave a like and subscribe uh, if you are new. And let me just give a big shout out to my two members. We have Judy, Giuliano Games, Random, Ahmed, Mr. Valkimo, Sorcerer, Noxon, Unreal Pete, Press GG, Hamath, Plain Punch, Stefano, Poppy Garcia Official, Damien, Zach, X Dread L, Stan, Proview Optical, Sieges Empire, London, Friendly Guy with a Spurger, NNA Blaster, Is Halarsan, Shaw Crow Lin, Jeremy, Bagor, Ghosty XL, 3WPS, Devil, Protax Haze, Ali Imran, Karin, Jeff, BB, Xares, Shadow Sparkles, Grimmermia, Overkalady, Fitzmagic, Massive Cool, Rosislav, and MK Fire. Thank you guys so much for being YouTube members. And also, we have some milestones here. Six months from BB, Grimmermia, over Overkill 80, Fitz Magic, Massive Cool, Rosy Slav, and MK Fire. You guys are all awesome. So now that you're at the end of the video, I do want to say goodbye, but before I say goodbye, I want to mention that Fusion Level 20 is not available at this time. It probably will be after we have so many combat passes to the point where they're going to have to start repeating them. And when they repeat them, uh, or in general, when they decide to start repeating combat passes, then they will offer Fusion Level 20. And I'm sure they're going to uh, unlock Friendship. But I don't think they're going to give us a third, or not third, a fourth weapon slot. I don't think so. Uh, but they could in the future. It is possible. One of the reasons why I know it's not possible, uh, because... If you use a, a gold character, even if the game thinks it's fusion level 15, if, a, if another equipment is added, the game will freak out and it will spam airs. And if it does that, then it's obvious that the game does not accept it as of now. But in the future, if that changes, I'll let you guys know. But yeah, guys, peace out.